right, survivors, welcome back to Shelter. Let's hop down into the bunker with the Punchwood family and pick up where we left off. We have survived so far for 45 days. Well, let's get rolling. Let's see if we can make it at least 46. We haven't had any casualties yet, though. Barb came mighty close to biting the bullet in the, in the last episode, right? There she is right now, in fact. She's feeling okay. She's not sick, no radiation poisoning, but she's very well injured. And she should be in bed right now. Oh, she's in bed right now, and Mom is checking in on her and making sure she's, uh, she's comfortable. Everybody else is kind of milling around. It's raining out, which is awesome. And we have full butts right now. Awesome. That is great. In fact, why don't we uh, get some people showering and stuff like that while we're doing nothing. Hey, Chris, place is a mess. Why don't you clean up? And let's take advantage of this rain right now, guys. So, ooh, 40, day 46, look at that. Let's get an expedition set up. So we found a new town down here to the south, southwest a little bit, Baychester. We have seen a petrol station and a couple of houses, and it looks like there's a house down there as well, but um, there's probably a lot more buildings to find. So I think what we're going to do is send Diane and Sarah back out. Um, but I think we need another... A mask, because we have one mask in stock, right? Yeah, one in stock. We've got supplies to make another one. Mom, go ahead and make another gas mask for your doctor, please. And now let's head over to the expedition. And we'll choose Diane. And Sarah. Wait, should we send... Let's send somebody else. Let's send Dad. What do you say? Sarah already went on an expedition. She's going to stay around the house today. Dad is a coward. He suffers from cowardice. Let's bring him out and turn him into a man. How about it? Diane will take care of him. <laughs> She's tough. So Dad and Diane will go check out Baychester. Most likely we're going to run into lots of opposition down here. Lots of people. Not necessarily opposition. Some people may want to trade. But I guess you can consider everyone kind of competitors, right? Competing for supplies and so forth. Uh, we checked that house. Let's check this one. So we'll do like a 45 water. That's a little more than half. But we should uncover um, some more territory here. How far south of Baychest do we want to go? How about like that? Not too interested in the petrol station. But we'll see what we can find in here. Maybe a factory, maybe a, a police station, maybe a scrap yard. We haven't found a scrap yard yet. That would be super awesome. Because I think we can get uh, car parts, RV parts, at the scrap yard. Among other things, we're also looking for... Um, uh, oh, no, no, no. I want the five rounds. Thank you. We're looking for hinges so we can upgrade... Our workbench. It's the last thing we need, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we're down about four hinges. All right, that looks good there. And why don't we give the party some Valium for trading purposes and maybe even... Uh, no, no, no. That's good. All right, that's good. I don't think they're going to do a whole lot of trading out there in the world. Um, let's give Dad a gun. We've got two handguns and four rounds of pistol ammunition there we go so they're they're packing some heat loaded for bear <laughs> and i hope nobody gets in their way but dad's gonna be turned into a man diane's gonna make sure of that there's our hinges man we need 10 total in fact let's go take a look at that and see exactly what we need so i know what to do when we're out there as far as uh what to pick up and what to trade for Think just two Valium should be enough? Yeah, they're going to find lots of loot down there to trade. For trading purposes later. And how about... We're going to let Barbara sleep a little bit longer. Let's open the door and let these two guys go. Go ahead, Dad and Diane. Good luck out there. Diane, turn him into a man, okay? Yeah, good job. <laughs> Don't let him overhear that. He doesn't need the ego hit. He did keep the, the, the family safe for a long time before we met Barbara and Diane. Dad did go out into the wasteland and found a lot of good stuff, didn't he? he? Put himself out there. Actually, Mom did too. And even Sarah, in fact. 
And while we call Sarah's name out, why don't we send Sarah out? Put on a suit, girl. Go shut off those lights. Sarah, here she comes. Grab the suit, disable that light. Disable that light. Save on energy. Go. Oh, 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 wait, somebody on the horn already. No, 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 Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. Hurry up, I don't want to miss this call, kid. Okay, they found a shack. Yeah, we sent him to the shack. Maybe get some ammo there on the way. Oh, man, the rain turned to black rain. How does it do that? How does it go from good rain to black rain? That's nice. Um, you know what? Before we get that phone, let me just check this upgrade. This is the one we're interested in right here. So we need uh, we need five more wires and one more circuit board. So hopefully we can find that today. Here's the decontamination upgrade, which we need a lot more plastic. That's going to be a long time because we need the plastic for gas masks. And the other upgrade is this one here, and we only need the hinges, as I had mentioned. Very lovely. All right, get the horn. Dad to base. Is somebody at the shack? We can sneak away or approach. Hey, Dad. Dad's usually the one telling people what to do, but uh, Mom's in charge today, so Mom says, you better get in there and get some ammunition. We could use the ammo. Oh, dear. There's four of them. Ah! And uh, who's this? Diane is. Hey, is that your blood? Ooh. Diane's getting bloodthirsty. We gotta keep an eye on her. Carolyn's gonna do the talking. It looks like this girl back here has a gun. Everybody else has melee weapons. They want to trade. Good. Okay. Whew. We just we just got out here. I don't want to get in a fight just yet. <laughs> and I don't even care what they have to say right now. No hinges. So I'm not interested in any of that, honestly. No, nope. get out of here. Lots of junk you guys have. I've hurt people for letting me down, but you weren't to know. Run along now. Okay, yeah. Yeah, run along. Get out of here so we can go through the shack. Found something at the shack. You sure did what you got. Oh, good. Another shotgun shell, which is nice. Rifle ammo. Uh, yeah, just grab everything. Then we can always trade it. We have plenty of space. These guys have 20 slots between the two of them and their satchels. Oh, Barb's up. We're going to send Barb up. Out right now, Barb, 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 Barb. We're gonna do a quick little thing for Barb here. Um, whoops. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. While she still has the anti-radiation coursing through her veins, I think we're gonna send her on a very short trip to the farm and the school and right on back again. And we got water coming in, which is nice. So now she does not obviously need the um. She doesn't need any gas mask. Uh, wow, we're down to one round of ammunition with the rifle. I'm going to have to give her an axe. She can handle herself with the axe. We do not have a satchel for you. So you're just going to have to go as is. And we'll send you some coal for trading purposes. That's it. It's not great, but... Coal actually fetches a pretty good penny. Believe it or not. And Barb go before that anti-radiation runs out. And let's check the clipboard and see how we're doing. The poor stove needs to be fixed. And the generator, let's do that right now. Oh, now the rain's good again. Nice. All right, let's get the horn. Get involved. Cross paths with somebody out in the wasteland. Uh, this is really not at all what I was hoping for. Oh, what's this? Hey there, hold up. It's Francis. Can I help you with something? Says Dad. Do you have a good place to stay? It's hard to find a decent roof nowadays. I'm willing to work for a nice place to stay. What you say? What you say? <laughs> I say no. We've got enough women in the house. We need some men. Sorry, Francis. You seem nice and everything. Uh, yeah, we are. Okay, good. Sorry. I might... We might recruit one more person and just kind of... Take advantage of him. Send him out in the wasteland without any protection. And just gamble with his life, essentially. Barbara. Found a small farm. Yeah, go ahead and check that out. Hey, Sarah, while you're down there, why don't you fix that? And we can get some showers going. Chris, go take a shower while we got the water coming down. 
And it's Barbara. She found someone at the farm. Oh, dear. Well, we want you to get inside that farm and see if there's any goodies for us. So, we're going to have to deal with it. It's Ruth. Ah, hello. Not seen many others out here recently. Right. Strength in numbers. Oh, she wants to join us, too. I'm sorry, Ruth, but you are the wrong gender. We're looking for male persuasion. And she's pretty good. As far as stats go. But, no. We're pretty full. Sorry, girl. Barbara found something at the small farm. Oh, oh nice. I right, grab that for trading. Plastic's awesome. Uh, oh, the wire for sure. The wood. Leather, absolutely. And the nail. Two pipes. Yeah, that's great. Good stuff. Bring it on back. Hello, this is Diane. We found a small house out in the wasteland. Should we check it out? No. I want you to keep going, Diane. Let's see where they are. Oh, wow. They're already at the town. Petrol station house. Oh, hardware store? Seriously? Ooh. Hey. Diane. Dad, can you check out the hardware store? I bet they have some hinges. I've never seen a hardware store before. Oh, and a pharmacy. Dang it. Okay. Hopefully they want to head over to the hardware store. I'm not sure. A school. Oh, this is Barb. Yes. Mom, get in bed. There we go. I love that. It's raining so much. It's Diane here. Small pharmacy. Yeah, check it out. All right, Barb's at the school. Go on in. Wow. The apocalypse elves stopped by. <laughs> Did a, a nice job. Okay, um, man, oh man. All right, that looks good, guys. I hate making these tough decisions, but what are you gonna do? She only has six slots available, and we can't make a bigger backpack until we get to tier three workbench, and I don't wanna waste the leather on a satchel, so we'll just have to live with it. Anyway, Diane and Dad are at the pharmacy. Go on in. Ooh. Well, we can pretty much fit all of it, which is fantastic, though I don't want all of it. <laughs> I imagine we'll bump into some people sooner or later and trade some of it off. Oh, who's this? It's Angela. Day 47, Angela came by. Hold on, Angela. Hey, Mom, it's Dad. Found a small police station. Yeah, definitely investigate that, Dad. We can get some more ammunition, maybe. Chris looks really tired, but he wants to wait for Dad to call back. He wants to know what's at that police station. Stumbled across the floors. No. Chris is like, no, Dad, get to the guns. Hurry up, I'm exhausted. But I'm so interested in what's happening here. Oh, Angela just walked right on by. <laughs> and Barb is back, lovely. And she's not um, irradiated. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and drop everything off, Barb. And why don't you go take a shower? Stop for one sec. Oh no, she's clean. She's clean. She's not tired. She's looking good. There you go. Cook yourself a meal. Good work. Now, oh, I think she wrote something in the journal. Grab this diary extract from a burnt out camp. Uh, okay. She just found somebody else's journal. Diane the base. We found some at the police station. Well, get in there, Diane. Give him some what for. We got to get inside. Look at that police station. It's all barred and boarded up, but there's a hole in the door so we can get inside. And it's Ronald with a knife. Diane's going to do the chatting. Not surprising, is it? We've got plenty of gear if you want to trade. Okay, see what you got. Ooh, oh, that's nice. Always nice to get a gas mask. And we have some space from other stuff. Oh, we need the circuit boards. Definitely need the circuit board. So that looks good. Hopefully that works out. Cheers, buddy. Been fun. Ronald, adios, amigos. Now let's get inside and get the good stuff. Oh, 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 oh. They're in, they're in, they're in. Yes, examine the items. <gasps> yes. All right. Ammunition for the gun. Leather. Um, We have enough batteries for the upgrades, so I'm not going to... 
Make space for that. Need more ammo. Rope is real nice. Let's get rid of that. Another gun, which is awesome for trading. So let's get rid of the Valium and trade, potentially trade the gun. We'll bring the battery back. Good enough. All right, Chris is going to go to bed now. He's like, okay, that was a good haul. Now that he's found out what they got from the police station, he's just going to hop into bed. Sarah, since you already have your spacesuit on, why don't we send you out to fix some things? Got nothing else to do. Found a church. Looks like it might have some good loot. I want you to keep going. And hold on, Sarah. What do we have here? Oh, they went right by the factory. School, factory, police station, and they didn't go to that hardware store, did they? Which is a dang bummer. Well, they might go to the factory, though, because they're still on their way down to the south. I know, I heard you the first time, Sarah. Hold on. Sarah doesn't usually wear the spacesuit, so that's why that keeps throwing me off. I want to say Chris. <laughs> it's Dad here. Oh, they found the, the factory. Good, yeah, get inside that factory. I'm thinking a factory's going to have hinges, maybe. Wires. I hope so. Well, that was fast. Man, we're getting good with these tools. 70% efficiency. You see how quick she is fixing that up? Well, she's a good. She's good at crafting and fixing anyway. Right, Barb's going to get the horn. It's Dad. Dad to base. There's people here at the factory. Barbara says, get in there, Dad. Be a man, Dad, for one, says Barb. <laughs> Uh, let's let Diane do the talking, though. It's Maria. Not surprising. The strength in numbers. My gosh, Maria, I'm sorry. But we don't need you. I'm gonna reject you. So, better luck next time, Maria. Just want to get in that factory. And there they are. They're in the factory. And hinges, hinges, hinges! No, but a saw! Wow! Never seen a saw before. That's cool. All right, well, we have, oh, we don't have a drill either. What do we have? We have a nail gun, a saw, and a drill. Oh, wow, our efficiency is going to go up another 20% probably then, right? Well, let's grab them. Get rid of the battery. Um, although, wait a minute. All right, hold on. This is going to take a second here. I need to figure out what I want to keep. I don't want that. All right, guys, that looks pretty good to me. We've got another circuit board, which is nice. That's going to help us upgrade our water filter. And it looks like we are out of gas over here. We sure are. Hey, Chris. I think Chris is sleeping. Mom, as soon as you're done doing what you're doing over there, eating a meal, can you please add some fuel to the Jenny? And now it's Sarah. And I need to, you to take that suit off, Sarah, because you, you keep throwing me off. I keep thinking you're your little brother. Actually, I think they're twins. He might be a little brother by like a minute, I think. Hi, it's Mom. Hi, hello, Mom. It's Diane here. We spotted somebody in the distance. Just sneak away, Diane. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, a scrapyard! Small scrapyard down there to the south, but they're not going to see it. Dang. Well, maybe if they see the house. Oh, no. They're already on their way back up north, so they're not going to go to that house. Small scrapyard. Oh, that's lovely indeed. Never been to one, but now it looks like they're not going to get down. They will have to... Set up yet another expedition, which we will do probably for the next episode. Medium house. Oh, man. Sure, I guess it can't hurt. Let's see where they're headed. Maybe it'll uncover even more. No, well, it's not that house. It's probably the one right in front of them. I think we've already been through that house, and I doubt the Apocalypse Elves have been back so soon. Uh, generator needs to be fixed up a little bit, as does the toilet. So, Mom, I thought I'd put you on that before. Barb, why don't you go fix up that toilet. I'll get the phone. Nobody at the house. Food. Petrol. Take that. So, the only thing I'm going to do here is swap the food for the antibiotics. Since we already have two antibiotics, and I've never actually ever needed one. No one's ever gotten any sort of infection, so... 
We'll go with that plan. So today's looking pretty good, guys. We've got full water. We've got lots of food in the pantry. More coming back. Place looks relatively clean. Everybody's mostly healthy. Hi, it's Diane. We found a small house. Yeah, check it out. All right, there's nothing useful at this at this house because we've already been there. So now we just want to hustle Diane and Dad back home. They did a good job in this town. We'll have to go back and check out that scrapyard. And I'm gonna hit the space, uh, the shift key, and speed up time, and try to get these guys home quickly. And we'll wrap up this episode. Strangers in the distance. No, 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 Dad. Just sneak away. We haven't met a lot of people on this expedition, which is surprising. Day 48. Nice. I want to get these parts back. Hurry up, run. I want the beds available for the two uh, scavengers that will be returning. And here they are. Right on cue. And Sarah, you need to feed the dog. And we'll put Chris on cleanup duty. Because I see an empty can. And here's... Diane and Daddy-O turning from their trek into the wasteland. Six locations searched. We've got lots of ammunition. Look at the goodies. Got guns, nails, more anti-rad, gas mask, another gun, two new tools. How awesome is that? And a little bit of chow. And wowzers, 120 experience on that trip. Very, very nice. Now, how you guys doing? Dad, 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 dad. No. Diane, don't eat. Don't eat yet. I need you both to take showers. Diane can go take a nap, and then she'll take a shower after her nap. Oh my gosh, look at that workbench. Our tool board. It's almost full. 90% efficiency. That is crazy. Hey, Sarah, I wonder... Can we upgrade this now? No, we still need wires. Did we find any wire? Still need four wires. I thought we had enough for an upgrade, but apparently not. But with that, we're going to call it quits. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.